Now we are doing exercise 12.3, question number 16. Question number 16, let me write down the question first. So here is our question. So let us write down solution. Now the question says a conical tent of height. There is a conical tent, tent made up of like type of cone, right? So sorry for the diagram, okay? Because I cannot draw properly here in the screen. So this is the conical tent of height. Height of this tent is, what is the height? 24 meter, 24 meter is the height. It's made up of canvas if the circumference of the base so circumference of the base is given as 44 meter so here solution given what is given h is equal to 24 meter right and second is circumference circumference of base so circumference of the base means the distance is if this circumference okay this is given as 44 meter what is the formula for circumference? Circumference is 2 pi r, circumference of a circle, same thing, 44 meter, no need to write meter. So let me calculate, r is equal to 44 divided by 44, okay, let me write down 2 into 20 to 7, into r is equal to 44, right. Now 2 into 20 to 7, it will be 44 by 7, into r is equal to 44. Let me find out r. r will be equal to 7 will go up. So 44 into 7 divided by 44 will come down. It will be 44 here. 44, 44 out and it is 7. So radius is 7 meter. Right? So if the circumference to find the volume of the air inside the tent. So I need to find the volume of the cone. Okay? If I need to find the volume of the air inside the tent, I need to find the volume of the cone. Right? So volume of the cone, therefore, volume of the cone cone will be equal to 1 by 3 pi r square h so which will be equal to 1 by 3 into pi that is 22 by 7 into r square that is r is 7 here so 7 into 7 r square h what is h h is 24 meter here so into 24 so 7 and 7 cancels 3 edge 24 right 3 okay 22 into 7 7 this one is cancelled one so 7 into 8 7 edge 8 7 is 56 22 into 5 6 56 2 it is 1 1 2 into 11 which will be equal to 1 1 2 into 11 so 2 3 2 1 1 2 3 2 centimeter cube so if you multiply these two you are going to get this one you multiply by any way i hope the answer is correct now the question is a little bit further i think so the question says something different so find the volume of the air inside the tent we have found out the cost of the canvas used at rupees 150 per square meter so they are asking like if this is the tent okay tent then what is the cost of the material use what is the cost of cloth used here so we need to find out first area so we need to find out curved surface area we need to find out curved surface area but for finding curved surface area formula for curved surface area is pi r l okay we know r but we do not know l so using pythagoras theorem using pythagoras theorem using pythagoras theorem c s a curved surface no no l will be equal to right root over h square plus r square i hope you can understand this one if this is the cone if this is l and this is height and this is r then r l square is equal to r square plus h square right so we can get l square l square to root over h square plus if you don't understand please write down in the comment below that's all so l is equal to root over h h what is h h is 24 so 24 square plus r what is r r is 7 so 7 square which will be equal to root over 24 square it will be 4 for the 16 6 1 in and 4 to the 8 8 to the 16 17 and 2 to the 4 1 5 5 7 6 plus 7 7 are 49 which will be root over 6 to 5 which will be equal to 25 
so we got the value of l is 25 centimeter right so this this is not centimeter cube this is meter cube sorry for my mistake and this is also meter right now therefore curved surface area curved surface area of the cone is equal to pi r l pi is let me write down here 22 by 7 r is 7 i think so r is 7 yes 7 meter so 7 into l pi r l so 25 7 and 7 cancel and if i multiply 22 into 25 i'm going to get 5 4 to 20 25 4 5 to 20 and 4 5 to 20 550 must be the answer so 25 into 22 is the 550 now the question is asking different us so the find the cost of the canvas use at rupees 150 per square meter so therefore cost of the canvas is equal to curved surface area that is curved surface area into curved surface area into price per meter square per meter square what is curved surface area we got curved surface area as 550 so 550 into price per meter square is given as rupees 150 so i can add on 150 okay if i multiply this to 550 150 so 5 of the 25 5 of the 25 26 27 5 of the 5 5 of the 5 and 5 7 5 12 5 6 7 8 8 2 5 0 rupees 8 2 5 0 okay so one more zero will be there so that this is the answer eight two five zero zero right so this is the answer that's all i hope the answer is correct thank you so much we will meet in next video